ready to go? You all ready? Using the dump station before we go, heading to Wyoming. actually said what we're doing. We are leaving Colorado. We should be uh, out of Colorado in about seven miles and heading into Wyoming. According to the signs, five. Five miles. We had a lot of fun in Longmont. We uh, went to the Cider Festival. There should be some footage that maybe Steve will put here somewhere of, of the Cider Festival. Got to drink a lot of delicious ciders and hang out. Even though it was super hot out, it was a fun time. And so hot. Yeah, it was hot. We somehow bring all the heat. I don't understand. We did a meetup with the local finance community and got to hang out with a bunch of friend, old friends and new friends and in general just had a really good time so in, uh, in Colorado. But now we're heading into Wyoming. We are actually going to be doing a ton in the next two weeks. But anyway, we are headed to Terry Bison Ranch. We're gonna spend one night there and uh, hopefully do some horseback riding. So we'll take you with us. While Courtney is getting us checked in here at Terry Bison Ranch, which is right over the Wyoming border from Northern Colorado, uh, I have to tell you a little bit of news. We're gonna be traveling around a lot in Wyoming over the next two weeks. And small world, one of the CEOs from a company that I used to work with follows us on YouTube. Hi. And um, he knows that we travel a lot and he contacted me to see if I might want to shoot some B-roll for him for his new company. Uh, so that's what we're doing here in Wyoming. We were gonna be through this area anyway, so we might as well knock out two birds with one stone. That's a fun project. Um, that sounds really interesting. Gets me thinking about video in a new creative way. And of course, we're gonna still do these YouTube videos. So lots, lots, and lots of things planned in the next um, two weeks or so. But that's gonna be really exciting, at least I hope. Um, and we're gonna see things that we probably wouldn't have ordinarily have seen if we weren't doing this little job. So it's kind of cool, something different, and I hope it's interesting for you guys, as interesting as it is, at least we hope it will be for us. And the goal is gonna be to shoot video that really screams Wyoming. This is what it's like to be in this state. And I think we're starting out on a good note. Got the old saloon, got the hotel, got the weird, creepy looking woman in the window, the dry goods, and of course, the guns and the jail. Yeah, this is gonna be good. We are all set up at Terry Bison Ranch. We are in this, basically this big grass field as you can see. Get out of the wind a little bit. So each spot has your electrical hookup. These have picnic tables but the rest don't. Um, we have water and electric for 41 a night I want to say. Uh, so it's not bad. 
The highway is right up there. You can see semis passing every once in a while. Don't really hear it all that much, at least right now, because we are basically the furthest away from the highway, which is cool. And this way, way out there, you could see free range bison. And that's probably what I'm gonna try to get some video of. Because bison, that speaks Wyoming to me. And, oh, we're filling up water, fresh water, because we came here with a completely empty waste tanks and almost empty fresh water tank. So we're taking advantage. Ah, it's done. Hello, buddy. Girls are not impressed by the little horses. Huh, you could care less. Patty normally gets all the, gets barking at all the puppies, all the dogs, but she's like, horse, don't care. What are we about to go do? Horseback ride. Yeah, we're gonna do a trail ride. Yes. Which I'm kind of excited about. We're both bringing our cameras. This one, this is what I'm gonna use for the job. This one, obviously, for YouTube. Yeah. Well, I've already explained the job to them. Oh, so good. They know what I'm talking and about. And this is a cool place. Did you talk about this place yet? Uh, a little bit, but not much. Right back there, those little black dots. Those are buffalo. Those are buffalo. Or American bison. Yeah, so there are like, you know, buffalo roaming and you can see them from your campsite. That's kind of awesome. Or these cabins. If the cabins around. would be amazing. They have decks out there that just look out over the buffalo and the train that they run. We might do the train tomorrow. We'll see what this trail ride's like. Yeah, we'll see. But let's get going. Let's go. This is Twister. Oh, not you. My horse. Wow, fun. that was fun. I could barely feel my butt. <laughs> we both haven't been on horses for a very long time. Yes. Um, it's been six years for me. And like, over a decade for me. Yeah. But Twister, my horse, was awesome. And uh, Splash, your horse, was pretty awesome too. My, my horse was like everything yeah. out there. Because he was, he was the biggest because I'm fat. <laughs> So I needed a, 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 you know, a substantive horse, sub, substantive horse underneath me to lug my 210 pounds. He kept wanting to eat as we walked. So did Twister, yeah. They were all well, really Twister. into the grass. But we got to see some antelope. We got to see some of their um, black Angus cows. We got to see some of their bison. We're thinking we're gonna do the train tour tomorrow morning before we leave to skip up close with the bison. That'll be fun. But that will have to be another video because I think this one's getting kind of long. So stay tuned for maybe that and uh, exploring Cheyenne, Wyoming. All right, here we go. Fun in Wyoming. Bye. Bye, guys. <laughs>